Hello, and welcome to Magic in the Madness. I'm your host, Andrea Sarmiento, and I hope you are all having a wonderful, relaxing, calm day. Good morning. Today is Tuesday, and I just, I have the worst freaking schedule. I don't know, I do it to myself. I go through the week thinking of a podcast idea, and then I do everything so last minute. I just recorded this morning and it's Tuesday. This is the day that I drop my podcast. I do it, I wake up early and I do it before I start working from home in like 20 minutes. And I finished it and I'm just like, wow, I need a better system. I need a better system. So stay tuned for that system when I figure it out. But as of right now, yes i have a podcast yes i haven't talked about it on my youtube channel but it's called magic in the madness podcast you can stream it on spotify apple Podcasts, wherever you listen to podcasts and i really want to put guests on this show if you haven't listened to it yet i would say the podcast is just about being relatable and being relatable in our 20s, growing into adulthood and figuring everything out. Finances, friendships, all of these things, relationships. And I'm just here to share my thoughts. And I definitely want to have guests coming up. I have a list of people that I'm thinking about um, making as a guest. I just haven't reached out because I'm freaking out. Like it's kind of nerve-wracking and I don't want to mess up. Um, so my first guest definitely has to be someone who can just go with the flow because I have no idea what I'm doing. Never done this before. But I know in my hearts of hearts that it will be great episodes having conversations with friends of mine, of people who I know a little bit about but don't actually know anything about, and just talking about real life situations. And yeah, it is Tuesday, it's supposed to be nice out. Gotta work from home today. Literally got up, took a shower, recorded a podcast, edited the podcast. I need to listen to it one time through before I download it and put it through on the hosting site to then publish today. But it's 8.13 in the morning, so that'll definitely be done by 9. And I'm just so excited, guys. I've been putting a lot of time and energy on the podcast, even though it does seem super last minute when I do things. But I just feel like good things are coming with this. And I'm just learning, I'm learning, I'm learning, I'm learning. Um, but I'm very appreciative of the people who have been listening since the start when in my learning phase so that is gonna be fun and interesting i have other ideas but i'm not gonna spoil them i just yeah okay thanks also outfit of the day for working from home we got a grout fit with this dining hall t-shirt from jnh at temple university i'm sorry for what i said when i was hangry and then the johnson and hardwick dining hall is on the back of the shirt. Also, I told the podcast this, but I will be moving in June. We don't know where yet. It might be Pat's current apartment. It might be somewhere new. And I'll be moving in with Pat, so that's a whole other life experience happening for me. I talk about it in the podcast with some life updates. Um, but also, hopefully, I get to vlog it as well. Moving in, moving out, living with a man. <laughs> Um, but I'm gonna miss her. She's cute. My one bedroom apartment. She's cute. Hello, hello, hello from my lunch break. Sorry, I literally ran out the door, forgot to bring the vlog camera. Um, but I'm sitting outside. It's like 70 degrees outside, right in front of the Constitution Center. And we're just vibing. We're thriving. We're living for it. And we're gonna go outside later to enjoy the cherry blossom trees by kelly drive um have a little picnic if you will but right now i am not eating during lunch i'm simply basking in the sunlight i just got done work um and because it's cloudy 
right now and it looks a little breezy as well. Pat and I actually are going to go to Kelly Drive to see the cherry blossoms and have a picnic tomorrow instead of today. It's gonna be sunnier all day, warmer all day. But we are going to go get snacks for that tomorrow um, because since I'm working in the office, it'll just take me a little bit longer to get home come back, you know, the whole shebang. So we're gonna be prepared. I'm putting my shoes on right now to leave. Oh my God, I'm okay. We're gonna head to the grocery store, get some snackety bobs. Hello vlog, it is the next day. <laughs> now we're gonna have a picnic. No, Just got not. off work. Let's take a left here. Yeah. Pat picked me up. We got all our stuff all set back here. We packed it all up nice. And can I just say, my makeup still looks good. I did a new makeup hack today. Makeup hack. It's <laughs> putting setting spray on and then powder over it. And then it lasts all day. But I'm excited, it's nice out. The trees are blooming, much blossoming. Nicer, uh, much nicer than yesterday. Yeah, yesterday just got cloudy around this time. Honestly, my makeup held out pretty good. My eyebrows are a little funky, but that's okay. Okay, let's see. Do you want me to carry one? I'll just hold this. Yeah, yeah. Where's the third in here? Party foul. Party foul. Already spilled it on himself. You know what I realized? What? We forgot crackers. <laughs> that we did. It's okay. Ugliest <laughs> unboxing of meats. Hey guys, it is Sunday. I'm about to go pick up Pat and we are going to Dalton Family Farms or Dalton Farms, one of those in New Jersey, uh, which is a tulip farm. And we're gonna go pick some tulips. It's nice out. I'm like in the skort. It looks kind of uh, risque when I'm sitting down, but it's cute, it's cute. I'm just trying to get some good pics out of it. Um, but we're heading out now and it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be cute. So sorry for being such a bad vlogger. I left my camera at Pat's after the picnic. Um, but now I have it and now you're coming along with us to another location because spring has sprung. Just come along and enjoy. <laughs> I have the pat tar here. I'm here. We're um, ready. Got the pill. Go <laughs> Just an allergy pill. Because this pollen, girl, look. Literally. It's bad. Can you okay, see you it? can't even tell. But this layer. Look at that one. Look at that dot. Yeah, that that's layer pollen. Looks pollen. Like and even like all of it, you can't even tell. Look at this, gross. And so, your girl needs an allergy pill just in case. Look at all these cars already here. What in the world? Wasn't expecting that. No way. Dalton Farms, here we are. <laughs> this is like when we went to the Renaissance Fair. Yeah, yeah. it's giving Renaissance. On our way. We're here. We're here to pick some tulips. Wow, look. Cute. Badass. Let's go. Might be a spy. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> okay, welcome. So straight out, we have black buckets that you can use to pick. 
When you pick the flowers today, hand upside down, go to the bottom of the plant and pull, and it'll come right up. There you go, the brochure has map of the property and information on how to pick your Thank you. Thank you. Which is going to be a diagonal back this way. Oh wow, there's a lake. I'm zooming in on the tractor. <laughs> wow, there's literally so many flowers. There's so many. It goes all oh the way God. down there. Stop. Where do we begin? <laughs> We picked our first tulips. This is mine. This is mine. It's looking good. Looking good. I got the root. That way it's longer. And then you can cut it however you like. I'll do better next time. Guys, tragedy happened. Look what happened to my bag. I ripped it. My strength was too much. We're live. Here we are. <laughs> Do a little twirl. <laughs> Headed to the daffodils. <laughs> like that. Like this? Mm-hmm. Put up first. Mm-hmm. Use a rubber. My flowers. So cute. Found some chickens. <laughs> Got my flowers. <laughs> Put this in there. I'm sweating, don't close it yet. <laughs> <I'm sorry>. <laughs> <laughs> my shoes are literally disgusting. Yeah. Ew. And then my bag broke. Okay, it's fine. We'll live. <sighs> All right, where should we go? Um, let's figure it out. We just had lunch slash dinner slash food at Cinder Bar. It was good. It was cute. And now I am stuffed. I'm quite stuffed. And could probably take a nap right now, honestly. You ready for bed? Yeah. Okay, we're back home and the tulips are looking a little, they need some water. I'm gonna put them in this. I don't know, does that look good? Good morning everyone, it is the next day. Um, I am checking on my flowers, my tulips, after poking a hole at the top of the stem. And they're looking amazing. They're standing up, they're looking great, they're looking beautiful. That's just a tip for you. If you go to the tulip farm, pick some tulips, poke a little hole at the top of the stem, and they're gonna look like this. Cute! On another note, my shoes from yesterday, like literally, can you see that? Foul, disgusting, gross. And they're white, so I'm gonna shove them into the washer. She's in there. Oh, I really look crazy. But my groceries are here. So yesterday I went to the doctors, right? And I was there for this ultrasound because there's just something happening in my neck region. Um, and so I got an ultrasound, she was taking a bunch of pictures, whatever. And I just got an email saying that my results are here and I'm gonna sign in and I'm kind of nervous. There's just like bumps like right here. I just don't get it. My right lobe is 1.1 centimeters by one centimeter by 4.1 centimeters. Thyroid description, the thyroid gland is normal in size and homogeneous in eco texture with normal vascularity 
no focal thyroid nodule is seen. There are several abnormal appearing, round, heterogeneous, heterogeneous, very hypo, oh, I can't even read this, as well as several similar appearing abnormal bilateral level four nodes. There is an additional abnormal node anterior to the isthmus, isthmus? This report has been flagged to inform the patient to contact their ordering provider to discuss the finding. Okay guys, who wants to see my thyroid gland pictures or whatever these are? Like what's that bubble right there? Another picture. Same thing. We're going this way. Like what? Should I get these framed? Like I don't even know what I'm looking at. Anyway, that's the results. But yeah, that is all for my health journey there. Hope you're enjoying your day. Hope you all are staying healthy and safe. Go to the doctors, get a checkup. Hopefully nothing's wrong with any of us. I think I'll end the vlog here because I have nothing really coming up in the next couple of days other than working and trying to figure some things out with my podcast. I'm really trying to get a grip on having a consistent you know routine for writing a script and uploading and having guests and all of that and i'm going on vacation a bunch in the next couple months so i want to really get this ball rolling on just getting it right but yeah thank you so much for watching if you know anything about ultrasounds please let me know she literally took a billion pictures um and I was like, hopefully, hopefully everything's okay. That's that. Thanks, guys. Love you all. Bye.